Hello, I'm Jeremy Thompson. I'm Managing Director of Mazda UK and I'm here to answer some of the most asked questions that we see on the internet today about this new car, the Mazda MX-30. Good question. We chose a battery with sufficient capacity to meet the needs of our customers' lifestyles without the weight penalty of a large battery which can blunt the handling and is less environmentally friendly. In fact, we know from looking at the digital service records of current Mazda owners that the average daily usage is around 26 miles. We call this battery choice right sizing, allowing us to develop a car that's great to drive, can be charged quickly, we can keep the price competitive and you are only charging for your daily needs, so it's also very efficient. So many long range cars pay a weight penalty and a lot of the energy in the battery is used to simply move the battery around so it's less efficient and the drive experience is not as fun. Yes, the MX-30 is a five door SUV but with freestyle rear doors which were previously available on the popular Mazda RX-8 rotary powered sports car. The MX-30's freestyle doors aid access to the rear seats as the B-pillar does not impede access but is now integrated into the door structure. They're also very safe as they cannot be opened unless the front door is opened first and we have the highest NCAP 5 star safety rating for side impact. I think they're a really neat design touch and they're another reason why the MX-30 has been awarded some of the best residual values for an EV in the UK. The MX-30 only requires one fixed gear, meaning, just like an automatic car, it's very easy to drive. The Mazda MX-30 has been specifically designed so that it feels as natural as driving a car with an internal combustion engine. It's even got a subtle engine noise. EVs make the most sense when you're able to charge at home starting each day with a full battery and from launch customers receive a free home wall charger, adding to the convenience and ease of ownership. One of the best ways to maximise the range of the Mazda MX-30 is through the use of regenerative braking. This is a system that is fitted to every electric and hybrid electric car to harvest excess energy that's produced when the driver applies the brakes or coasts with the foot off the accelerator. Rather than energy being lost, as it is in a conventional internal combustion engine car, this energy is redirected to the battery, generating free miles which can extend the driving range. In the MX-30, there's a choice of regenerative braking modes that you can select on the go, reflecting your driving style or the type of roads that you're on. And you can also check your charge status using the new My Mazda app. Cork is one of the original renewable materials. It doesn't require trees to be cut down and every time a cork tree is harvested it absorbs carbon dioxide as it regenerates. But in the case of cork in the MX-30 this is offcuts from bottle cork production so no trees were harmed in the production of the cork inserts. It's tough too. The specially designed coating accentuates the natural characteristics of the cork while ensuring the quality and the durability you'd expect from a Mazda. It's even tested to the same high standards as any other material used in our interiors. Incidentally, the use of cork is a reflection of our beginnings as a Hiroshima-based cork processing company called Toyo Cork Kogoyo in 1920. That's it for now until we receive more questions about this exciting new introduction to the Mazda range.